Hi, my name's Marcus, work at Fernhill Farm as a chef. Hi, my name's Chris, I work at Fernhill Farm and I'm in the kitchen with Marcus or I'll be out and about on the farm helping out. A um, bit of everything really, we try and cater to everything. We've got camping barns, so we get a lot of people staying in camping barns, whether it's a stag party, wedding, um, as well as a lot of educational work with anything from troubled teenagers to disabled, showing them how a farm works. I think it's really important to educate people where their food comes from, which is what we try and do here. It's lambs, lamb for dinner tonight, the lambs are in the field there, you see them walking around. You can come and watch it all go into a hole this afternoon in a hungy and you can take it out the other side. So I think it's really important people see what what they're eating and where it's from. I think it's what really shook me was we had the stewards all come up and we had loads of kids from London come up and I was I was shocked that how many of them hadn't actually seen what a cow was. You were, you know, they sit in books but they'd never actually seen a real cow, seen a real sheep, and then to see it cooked in front of them after they'd just seen it, they were shocked. It was yeah. Massive eye opener for me and for them as well, so yeah. Yeah, cool. It's good to get people out of the city sometimes as Very well. Very much so. One lad said to me, um, I said, what's the weirdest thing? He, I think he had quite a troubled background. He said, what's the weirdest thing being up here then? So he seems a bit out of his comfort zone to start with. He said, the weirdest thing, he said, total silence. And he was sat outside and he couldn't hear anything. He said, that's the first time in his life he's heard nothing. Not a siren, not anything. When the festival's here, yeah, it's all, it's all good. It's chaos. It's all a good laugh. Loads of work, um, loads of people on site, just it's great fun. Um, and it brings the you know, more and more people see the farm. So the more people that get to the festival, the more people can see the lovely camping barns, the work that Marcus does in the kitchen, which is awesome. Um, and really we can sort of, you know, let people know we're here. Um, and they, we get people coming back on their own afterwards. And they're always so happy people. That's what we like. Never any trouble, just happy people wanna have fun. And that's what we're about as well. So we seem to match quite well, so keep bringing them on. I think they're the way forward, really. I think there's so many, so many festivals that have just gone out of their, out of their zone. It's too much, too much to get in. 200 quid for right, a ticket. Rough, guys, but we're, get we're, 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 the job's on and we need you up there. Yeah. Go. Go for it, guys. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs>